Miss Speed Rack Chicago going to New York is Miss Jessie Nielova! Hi. <laughs> I'm feeling really good. A little overwhelmed. We would like to welcome you to Speed Rack Chicago, the last stop on season four national tour. This is the first year that my mom and dad are not gonna be here, um, and it's because my mom has uh, a surgery really early tomorrow morning. Um, she was diagnosed with very early stages of breast cancer. Um, so it's, it's super important for me to, to be here today. I've been working really hard. There's a lot of really deserving girls out there, but I, I really just, I really wanna do it this year. <laughs> I'm super stoked about the judging panel. Chicago's got such a rich culinary and beverage community that these guys are all heavyweights and badasses. Beautifully structured, nicely strained. It was, it was delicious. No penalties. Just a little heavy handed with the vodka. I tasted a little bit too much winter wheat. Wowie scotch. There was a whole lot of scotch in it, which isn't a horrible thing. I do want to taste some scotch in my Rob Roy. Yours was a little Fernet heavy. Also, it could have been a few degrees colder. These eight ladies are tight. I've met some of the most wonderful and talented and strong women in my life here through this. Yesterday, I had a Taekwondo tournament and double gold in Indiana. So hopefully I can carry on to today, but I'm going against Jossie. Mmm. This is my third speed rack. The pressure is definitely on to make absolutely perfect drinks. As long as I can stay cool and calm, I think that I can definitely win it. Everybody like really loves each other and they support each other and they're like, yeah, you're awesome. You're awesome too. Do you want to be more awesome? I'll help you be more awesome. I am a two-time speed rack champion. I've won twice in Chicago and I've done pretty well in nationals. Everybody wants me to lose. That's why I should win today. I love the fact that there is an awesome purpose behind this and that is to raise money for charity. I'm gonna go and give it my all. You know, if I lose to Liz Pierce, nothing to shed tears over. Jessie Arda Oliveira, my training partner for three years. She is a goddamn gangster. Growing up in Japan, I have a little bit of a different approach to cocktails. Cut the zone. What does that mean? I won. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much my whole family's gonna be here. They've never seen me work. So this is like a weird little introduction into my world for them. My parents are like first generation, off the boat Arab Catholics. I love them, they're great. I got all zeros, perfect score. That's actually even my second goal next to winning speed rack, getting a perfect score. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the first round of the semifinals. These are two of the toughest competitors in Speed Rack, period. Chicago, are you ready to see the grudge match? Three, two, one, go! Jossie, I thought you did a terrific job. I would like to have seen a little more dilution. Liz, I like this drink, but it was like an absinthe bomb. I thought it was anybody's round, to be honest. I'm really fucking stoked to see what happens next. It's gonna be a really tight round. Go! Aaron, you gave me a pick up. I knew it was gonna be close. Her garnishes were absolutely beautiful. My Mexican firing squad was super tart and I just added a little simple at the last minute. Chicago, are you ready for the finals of Speed Rack? <laughs> Three, two, one, go! Jossie was, was a little bit more chartreuse -y. Both of them were executed properly. I would like to have felt a little more pisco in each one. When you use the bourbon, I really want to taste it 
and um, it came to me kind of like really watery. To win is a huge honor. It means a lot to me because I get to call my mom now. I'm just really happy to tell her that before she goes into surgery tomorrow. Her breast cancer was diagnosed super early because of all these preventative methods that we get from all this research and funding from things like this is pretty unbelievable. So I'm just so excited to talk to her and, and yeah, uh, let her know.